Hey y'all, so today I got for you this really incredible star sapphire ring. It's set in PT900 Platinum and it has this beautiful array of baguettes all the way around. You can see that star is very, very bright and clearly natural. It's a, um, it's blue and has a touch of gray, but I'd say it's more blue than gray. So not perfect color, but good color. Show you the side of the ring, underneath. It has a lower set to it, which is pretty nice. We're going to zoom in and I'm going to show you some of the markings on the inside of the band. So, as you can see right there, it's D0.31, which is the diamond total carat weight, and then S3.06, so that is the star sapphire's weight in carats. And then you can see the back, if I can get it to hold, there you go. And on the other side we have the marking PT900, let's see if I can get it to zoom in. So there you go. It says PT900. For those of you wondering, that's 90% platinum and 10% palladium. So platinum, so I just wanted to address something. Platinum is actually more expensive than gold. And let me go over that. Yeah, I know that 90% um, platinum is probably the same worth. Maybe, actually I think it's less than 18 karat. I think it's probably about the same amount as 14 karat per gram. But you have to understand, not many people deal with platinum, like jewelers, they don't want to deal with platinum. It has a higher temperature, so in order to get it to fuse and start creating castings or anything like that, you have to get it to a higher temperature. So the cost of manufacturing goes up, on top of it being speci specified. Most jewelers do not deal with platinum. You typically have to go to a higher end jeweler, and if you don't, I guarantee you it will not come out right. You must use a laser welder, especially when resizing platinum or trying to fix any prong or trying to reset a stone. If you try using a torch, it will not go well. So this ring is going to be going on eBay for $1 starting. And you'll be able to bid on that if you want to. And if you want to be able to find it, you can go to the description in this video and go to the... Uh, eBay link that's there. That'll take you to the store. Once you get there, go to the auction page. Once you're at the auction page, you'll be able to find this and other rings. This is going to be going on probably November 30th or maybe Thursday the 1st. Actually, I might put this up for the following week. We'll just have to see. Really, really beautiful ring. If you can, please like and subscribe. You'll be able to see more beautiful rings like this and you'll be able to see what's going up for auction before it gets there. I really appreciate you guys watching and have a great day.